Hello Virgo, it's my lady and this is my lady's way tarot and my neighbor just started vacuuming his porch or something. I don't know. He just started making some noise, but excuse, excuse that. Um, but I'm here to do your weekly love reading for the week of April 17th through the 24th, 2023. The cards I'm using today are First, Wisdom of the House of Night by PC Cast. And I'm closing off with uh, Terror of Dreams by Kiro Marchetti and Lee Bernstein. <coughs> I want to thank everybody. Oh, I need to drink some tea. For like, sharing, subscribing. Okay, you got some stuff jumping out. Mm. And setting up personal... Oh, readings with me. Okay. It's all jumping out. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. All right, let's see what's going on with the Virgo. Okay, so you got some stuff going on here. You got a lot of stuff jumping out. A lot of secrets look like it's getting ready to happen, but it looks like it's going to be a lot of intuition going on in this one because everything that I see right here is very vague, so I'm going to have to look for some pictures, okay? Okay. All right, okay. So we got the love card here. So I do feel like, of course, somebody's in love. There's some love going on here somewhere. Oh, then I'm gonna flip the back card because it look like we need six. Oh, broken an oath. All right, so I look like somebody um, broke, broke an oath. Just like I said, I feel like I pledged, I vowed to somebody and it's just not happening, okay? All right, so I'm gonna pull the cards. I guess starting this way. All right, so we got the high priestess of earth. So, oh no. <sighs> so we got this high priestess of earth and we got this broken vowel card. So I do feel like we got some body changes happening and it's happening after somebody broke an oath, okay? Body changes after somebody broke an oath. Oh goodness. All right. So we got the hope card here. So I do feel like somebody's hoping that something isn't happening and isn't true. And right now I'm feeling like I'm hearing two things. I feel like there could be a child or there could be an STI. Okay. But it looks like somebody brought some stuff into this relationship that cannot go away easy. Okay. Not easy to get rid of. Okay. All right. So we got the success card here. So this makes me feel like. I feel like I've been looking for something. I've been looking for this. And I'm getting Scorpio energy. Um, I feel like I've been looking for this for a long time or looking for some kind of answers. I feel like I finally got the answers, okay? So, crazy stuff. I feel like I finally got the answers I was looking for, I was hoping for, okay? So, it's like his body changes. I want to know what this person is doing. I need signs. I need, but these signs that's coming out. I wasn't expecting it. I just asked for signs so I know now what is happening, what is going on, okay? All right, so we got the high priest. No, this ain't a high priest. This is a focus card. So I, I feel like just dealing with this situation, feeling everything is wrong, these changes going on in my body, I noticed something right. It helped, it's not letting me focus. And I do feel like this is caused by something that this person has done as well, okay? All right, so we got the high priestess of spirit. So this makes me feel like family, friends, co-workers, people that around you love you, they know what's going on. And I do feel like mostly spirit guides and ancestors, they're coming to your dreams and they're showing you stuff. They're showing you stuff and signs to let you know what's happening to you. And you need to go do whatever to get it. Basically, you need to go get checked up, checked out, see what's going on, going wrong, okay? And I do feel like if it's not physically nothing going on with your body, be expecting a message to come in about somebody on the outside who is expecting or who is saying that somebody in your relationship has their child, okay? All right, so we're going to pull some cards from, what is this? The Tarot of Dreams by Kiro Marchetti and Lee Bernstein. Okay. So let's see what's going on with the oh goodness. Alright, so I felt like somebody just grabbed my arm and like pulled me back like right here. Okay. So I do feel like if you do confront this person with this information, don't be mean, don't be aggressive, don't be disrespectful. 
don't be in the area just be on the phone because first thing somebody want to do when they get caught doing something they don't have no business doing this person this i don't know if it's everybody else but this person is going to get aggressive so be away from this person when you tell them about the information you know because they're going to try to take it out on you like you did it okay so go somewhere else when you let them know and if you want to tell them over the phone if you don't want to tell them they don't deserve the information i just disappear into the night okay um but it's all on you but this person is i feel like they can get physical so definitely want to stay away from this person when you learn this information okay all right let's keep going with six of cups so with this six of cups i just seen if this is for you this will be coming out pretty soon um if it hasn't already just come out so just be aware and be prepared but if you already got that feeling and you're getting these dreams and you got people um that act like they want to tell you something but then they feel like you're gonna freak out so they just like never mind i'll tell you later or try to change the subject you know when it's you okay Dang it. We got the deaf card reverse. Okay. So this definitely can mean a lot of things. Um, but definitely somebody stopping some kind of transition from happening. Okay. Um, this also means that uh, somebody could be <sighs> passing away slow. Okay. So if this your situation got something to do with you, you already know what's happening. You know what's going on. Okay. Um, but I said earlier too, I felt Scorpio energy this is a scorpio card okay um this usually don't matter but i'm hearing moon sign this could moon sign could be the scorpio card okay so it could be scorpio could be their rising a card okay but i do feel like somebody's in a uh i don't like this because i'm hearing words that i don't like to say i'm feeling tragic okay but definitely somebody's in a transition and trying to or, or getting ready to get out of a toxic situation so just when you leave or, or tell this person you know do it from a different place of that that they're in different place and do it respectfully okay even though they really don't deserve it just try to do it because this person is going to get aggressive okay all right what we got here so we got the nine of swords reversed here so i do feel like a lot of dream uh, missions a lot of stuff going on in your dreams okay and i do feel like with all this stuff going on in your dreams you're not listening okay you're not listening and i do feel like somebody i saw somebody taking some pills okay uh, but somebody's trying to overlook the anxiety of it okay i do feel like somebody doesn't want the anxiety of it so they try to cut it all off cut it all out cut it off okay all right so we got the justice card here so just sit back you don't have to do nothing to this person this person is going to get what they deserve okay this is also the libra card um so i do feel like with this libra card balance will be restored okay so whatever this person has done or is doing to people they're going to get their payback for it okay but i honestly do feel like this person is like multiple people giving stuff to multiple people or um possibly multiple people could be the father or somebody is getting multiple people pregnant okay but it's something that has to do with a body change that is not an overnight issue okay it's a long-term issue that this person is jumping around doing to people purposely okay while they're in a relationship disrespectful okay all right all right so we got the knight of pentacles here so i do feel like somebody got a little sum of money getting ready to come to them and with that money my two cents i would take it and run away okay because this person is dirty and they ain't gonna do nothing but be even more dirty okay they're just a dirty individual oh wow so we got the eight of cups here so this makes me feel like two things i'm feeling from this card first of all somebody went away and i do feel like when you go away some of you guys are scared of what's gonna happen everything gonna be all good okay everything gonna be all good as long as you don't let this person contact you i feel like for some of you guys this person is trying to contact you because it's retrograde and retrograde these people come out the walls out the dirt out the ceiling out the sewers out the toilets they come from all kinds of places to try to recontact us okay i do feel like once you're gonna get gone 
it's gonna be great but i do feel like for some of you you left this person and you went back and that's when this happened so if you left somebody and you're getting ready to go back think about that that person been doing all kinds of stuff so if they don't want to meet you at the clinic don't meet them up for coffee all right other than that that's all i have for you guys make sure to check your sun moon and rising signs thanks for watching